Hi, and welcome to Cuckoo Games. And in this vid, we're going to be doing a Battle Victoria 2.0 build. Yes. And in this build, we're going to be focusing on Victoria's luck and stamina. And the reason why we're doing a 2.0 build is because the devs, they nerfed the first aid sprays, how many spawn in a match. And so instead of using um, Medic, we're going to be using Thick Skin. Also, we can't rely on other counselors to be alive, so instead of using Friendship, we're going to switch it up and use Slugger. And this whole build is going to be focusing on solo gameplay. Like, you're not going to be wanting to be around other counselors because they're just going to mess up this whole build. So the first perk we're going to be using is Slugger, which gives us a 15% attack damage increase, as well as a melee attack speed increase. And this combos really well with Swift Attacker, which is going to give us a 20% attack speed increase, as well as a 3% increased stun time on Jason. And since we're going to be up close and fighting Jason a lot, we're going to want to use Thick Skinned instead of Medic. And the reason why we're using the Thick Skinned, like I said previously, the devs nerfed how many first aid sprays spawn in a match. And if you start off with the match next to Jason, you don't want to be worried about, oh, I need a first aid spray. He's throwing knives at me. He's breaking windows. You want to just be able to move around and fight Jason and make him ton of you and still de deliver high damage and drop him down into the floor and keep him stunned for a long time. So let's check out some gameplay footage. Thanks to our 15% attack increase, we have a good chance of dropping Jason down onto the floor, which makes it harder for Jason to recover quicker from his stun. Combined with our 3% stun time increase, Jason will be struggling to get back up really quick. Also do note, if you do have a penalty on your swift attacker for the stun chance, it will affect whether or not you do stun Jason. Even though the baseball bat's supposed to stun every single time, if you have that slight stun decrease, you won't be able to all the time. Because Victoria has high stamina but low speed, she can travel great distances, however, she's going to run out of stamina pretty quickly. So what you want to do is land hits on Jason to recover that stamina, and that's why this build works really well with her. This covers all of her weaknesses, as she does have low attack and low speed, but this build makes it that her attack and speed do not matter, because she's going to recover her stamina and drop Jason down onto the floor when she needs to. Thank you for watching. Go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!